All right, hey guys, Tic Tac here, and today I'm gonna teach you how you can make any microphone that you have, guys, sound like a studio quality microphone. And the software we're gonna be using today, guys, is called Voice Meter. So before we get into any tutorials like how to download it or how to use it, I'm gonna give you a sample without using Voice Meter and a sample of using Voice Meter. So yeah, I hope you enjoy. So this is what it sounds like without using Voice Meter. And this is what it sounds like using Voice Meter. So guys, as you probably heard, the one with Voice Meter sounds a lot better than the one without Voice Meter. So what I'm gonna do now, guys, is go straight into the tutorial to show you how you can download it and use it for yourself. So yeah, let's get straight into it. So guys, the first thing you have to do is go down into the description down below and click on the link for Voice Meter. And once you open that, guys, just go down to the install tab right down here. And you wanna hit download for whatever version you need. And once you hit download guys, just go through the simple installation process and you'll be greeted with a page like this. And from here, you wanna go to hardware input and it's the one with number one and just hit on that. And you wanna select what microphone you have. So you might be using a blue snowball, I'm using a blue Yeti, so just select whatever microphone you have. And this is the gain right down here guys. And I just left this at minus 2.5. I think it was like 1.6 at the start, but my computer is pretty loud. So I just leave it down at minus 2.5. Um, and if your computer is quite quiet and you want to hear your voice and you want to sit back more, just bump it up more to hear your voice more. And from here guys, let's go do A1 and I selected this because it works best for me. So it's KSV, whatever this is, dash point audio or audio point. And you have to see what works best for you, but this is what works best for me. And from here, just mute these two because you don't really need this. So what I'm going to do next is a voice control panel. And from here, this is where I think it sounds best, right bang and center in the middle in the LO part, meaning low. And But if you're a girl, you might want to move it around because uh, you don't really want your voice to sound too masculine. And if your voice is already broken, you might want to keep it bang center in the middle like this or might want to move it down more. But that's really all with voice meter, guys. So if you enjoyed today's video and it helped you out, please like, comment and subscribe, guys. It would be awesome. So see you guys and I hope you have a nice day.